An event billed as a crime gun summit was held at the Mountain Health Arena in Huntington Wednesday, where law enforcement from Boyd County to Putnam County met for a training session. Everybody has limited resources, so this is a way for us to be very efficient and effective. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives Louisville Division partnered with the Huntington Police Department for this. The goal, strengthening gun crime investigations. As technology uh, advances, the time frame in which we can turn around investigative leads and connect crimes, we're making it faster and we're making it larger. On display, a resource that can trace guns used in crimes, the National Integrated Ballistic Information Network, which uses technology to examine bullets and guns found at crime scenes and connect them to guns used at other crime scenes, even if that crime was in another part of the country. Take that 3D model and compare it to the hundreds of thousands of the same caliber over in the National Correlation Center. And there's some new technology being used that will help us solve cases quicker and faster. Uh, it also make local law enforcement aware of the things that the ATF has to offer and the resources and personnel that can use to help them and assist in solving uh, crime and uh, helping reduce the violence that's occurring. As much as we know our criminal element likes to transport themselves uh, uh, from one area to the next, it just keeps us ahead of the game in the ability to catch, uh, catch criminals. The ATF Louisville Division is holding a series of these trainings across Kentucky and West Virginia. Andrew Colgrove, WSAZ News Channel 3, Huntington.